welcome to the OWC instructional series of videos. In this installment, we will be adding a second hard drive to an early 2009 Mac Pro. We have already gathered our materials, shut down, and unplugged the Mac Pro. We have placed it on a soft, static-free surface and are now ready to begin. First, we will need to open the side access door. To do this, lift the latch located on the rear of the Mac Pro until it locks in the open position. You may then tilt the door forward slightly and remove it. The four hard drive bays are located across the top part of the center section. The stock hard drive is installed in the leftmost bay, but we can put another SATA drive in any of the other three. Just grab the lip of an empty carrier and gently pull it straight out of the Mac Pro. Looking at the drive carrier you just removed, you will see there are four screws. These screws line up with the four holes on the bottom of the hard drive. With the SATA connector on the drive facing away from you, line up the holes with the screws as shown. Then. Tighten them in. Once the screws have been tightened, simply push the carrier back into place, making sure it is firmly seated. You may now replace the side door and close the latch. Once you boot your computer, the OS will detect a new drive and ask if you wish to format it. For formatting instructions, please visit this URL.